Hi everyone and welcome to the latest edition of Pompey Women Vlogs. We're at Prince's Park for London City Lionesses versus Pompey Women in the FA Cup. Thanks for joining us for another match day vlog. Yeah. Massive challenge for the girls today, yeah. Avi. So let's get, add some context if you don't know. London City Lionesses are top of tier two, the women's championship. They're an exceptionally good side. This is a massive test for the girls today, yeah. Avi. I mean, this is where we're gonna want to be aiming for like the future, these kind of teams that we're gonna be playing in the future. And yeah, it is gonna be a tough game for us because they're now they're top of the championship, so. Yeah, these are the sorts of games that, you know, don't come along that often. Um, this is as tough a test as you'll get, um, you know, top of the tier above. Uh, a league which we obviously want to get to as soon as possible. So yeah, really big test for the girls. I know they're really excited. Um, yeah, it should be a good game. So we've just arrived at Prince's Park. Should we give them a look? It's very windy, so yeah. hopefully it's not too muffled, but let's have a look around. So home of Dartford FC, I believe. So yeah, players are warming up. So yesterday, Abby, we uh, went to the Tottenham game, didn't yeah, we? Yeah. So the guys did brilliantly, didn't they, yesterday? Yeah, they did really well, especially against Tottenham. Like, they, I mean, we couldn't have asked for much more, really. I no, mean, and that's exactly what we're looking for today, isn't it? We're looking for exactly that same performance from our women today. You still got your ticket. Yeah. So yeah, um, players are warming up. The lineup's out, isn't it? Yeah, it's up. So let's see who Jay has selected to start this game today. In goal, we've got Hannah Horton, then we've got Nicole Barrett, Jazz Younger, Captain Dan Rowe, Izzy Collins, Danny Lane, Ava Robotham, Leanne Bell, Annie Rolfe, Sophie Quirk and Anaya Harney. On the bench, we've got Libby Kingshot, Ella Humphrey, Ella Wilde, Anisha Hill, Jess Smith, Taylor McDonald, Tierney Scott, Mae Gordon and Mia Adaway. Feels like we're in a rave, busting some shakes. Right, that's the lineup. Um, as strong as it gets bar Emma Jones um, obviously a, a key player for Pompey but she picked up that ankle knock for Christmas so she's unavailable so that's a chance for Anaya Harney and potentially Mae Gordon to come on later so yeah excited for the yeah, game big match I'll say it's not often we play uh, teams from the tiers above so I'm really excited to see what this squad can do we're going to have to look good like shifts well yeah of course we are and we, you know, we've had a really good start to the season uh, for such a young squad and yeah really excited Oh, just now it's they've got a, a scoreboard. Did you not know? No, I didn't see that. So there we go. Let's see how the girls get on in the first half.
So half time here, London City Lioness is one Pompey nil. Abby? I thought we played really well and we're definitely pressing really well and their goal I don't think was a goal, it's a bit like... Yeah, so the ref gave the goal but we obviously couldn't tell, we're at the other end, we couldn't tell if it went over the line or not but the Lino didn't give anything and the ref overruled and gave it which is a bit disappointing but you know Pompey did really well, a few um, brilliant saves from Hannah kept us in it, she did really well didn't she? she? Yeah. In sort of like the first 20 minutes. Um, Hannah was called into action several times and made some brilliant saves but after that the game really settled and Pompey really came into it almost scoring um, in the closing stage of that half so plenty to play for in the second half um, Pompey are really fit side so I don't see us fading off in the second half uh, it's just whether we can be brave and push on for that equaliser but yeah great first half and let's see how we get on in the second half Okay, full time here, London City Lionesses won Pompey nil. Um, so disappointed. Um, Pompey were exceptional today. They gave absolutely everything. That is a proper Pompey performance. Guts, fight, determination, didn't roll over. And it got to the point where London City Lionesses, who don't forget, are top of tier two, aiming to go up. 
they were reduced to time wasted in the corners at the end. That's how much pressure we put them under and how much they feared us. And you cannot give Pompey more credit than that. That was absolutely brilliant. Mm -hmm. Abby must be proud of the girls yeah, today. Yeah, they did really well today. And you, as you see, you can't fault that effort. They kept they kept going. And like as you said, like they're they're top of uh, the championship and they're time wasting. Like that should be a compliment. Yeah, it's really good. I mean. We're just one officiating decision away from an equaliser. I mean, we haven't obviously seen the footage back yet. By now, you would have obviously seen it in the highlights. But you had their goal, was it over the line? Not sure. And then Mia's, I think it was Mia scoring as well in the second half. That yes. given offside. Was it offside? I don't know. You would have seen by now, obviously. Annie. But, oh, was it Annie Rolf? Yeah, Shoot. Annie, Annie oh, Rolf. Well, I couldn't see because I was down the other end making sure the camera's still recording for your highlights. But... Yeah, I mean, I'm so, so proud of the girls today. They really gave it their all. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, really good. They, they should be proud of themselves. Well, thanks for joining us. Hope you enjoyed the vlog. Not the result we wanted, but most definitely that was the performance we wanted. What a gutsy performance from the girls. A big shout out to London City for giving us press passes today. Um, that allowed us to get around the pitch and film and gave us the access we needed. Uh, and then for Express FM, big thanks to them for covering the game on the radio. That, that really helps uh, boost the women's team. So thanks for joining us. Hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you next time.